UK government has set the target to install 600,000 heat pumps each year by 2028. And given that there are just a little over 200,000 heat pumps installed in total across the UK, that is a big task. So how on earth do we begin to climb this almighty mountain? Well, octopus think that they may have the solution, or at least for 80% of homes in the UK for whom it could just cost 500 pounds to install a heat pump. Well, we've come here to find out how, and this is the Everything Electric Show. Like Everything Electric? You'll love our fun-packed Everything Electric Expos around the world. Come join us in Harrogate, Farnborough, and Vancouver. Remember, energy and transport professionals go for free. What is the Cozy 6 exactly and how is it different from other heat pumps that also exist on the market? The Cozy 6 is something that we believe can really bring a lot of innovation to the market. The Cozy 6 has a couple of real sort of selling points. The first thing is we think we can actually make a heat pump which is significantly uh, more affordable. The second is we think we can make a heat pump which is significantly more efficient. So we're using R290, it's propane. Uh, there is a couple of other commercial heat pumps on the market that also use it at the moment and is really digitally integrated with everything else that Octopus does, uh, such as tariffs um, and the Octopus Energy app as well. The heat pump app is actually the exact same app as the energy app. Ours is all integrated into one place, so you can both see your energy usage and your heat pump usage and how those two things are interacting. Um, I think that's extremely uh, helpful and a, a great sort of easy gateway to, to uh, allowing people to understand their heat pump a little bit better. We also have a couple of other things, the Cozy Hub and Cozy Pods, which are also developed in-house um, by an amazing, uh, mostly female-led firmware team, which is awesome. And uh, they're integrating all of our own technology into things like room temperature sensors uh, and all of the governance and the indoor controls for the heat pump are part of the cozy range as well. So this is it. This is the Cozy 6, the brand new heat pump from Octopus Energy. And I have to say, the thing that strikes me immediately is that when we think about heat pumps, we're so used to seeing very bland, white cubes and this is definitely not that not least because it is not just a white box it's an interesting shape it's made of a material that feels a little bit more robust a little bit more hard wearing something that you'd be used to seeing outside or perhaps you'd expect to see outside the other thing is that you have this fan here that on a hot day it'd be quite nice to stand here and get the cold air i think that's a another little bonus that you've got your own cooler in the garden as well i'm not sure what the optimum design of a heat pump is but would you be happy to have one of these in your garden? Or how would you design your most perfect heat pump? What would it look like? What would be the thing that you'd be happy to have sat outside your home? A lot of heat pumps available on the market today are low temperature heat pumps. And what the Cozy's is, is a high temperature heat pump. What's the difference between the two and why might most homes be better suited to a high temperature um, heat pump? High temperature heat pumps are actually a relatively recent uh, innovation in the market and they're just being rolled out now. The difference, the main difference is the type of refrigerant. So we use something called R290, which is propane, and that allows for a significantly higher temperature heat pump, but it also allows for a significantly more efficient heat pump as well. Um, of course, everybody wants efficiency in their home. Uh, it's how much uh, your coefficient of performance, something that's often used in, in heat pump terminology, uh, is able to provide versus a gas boiler um, or, and versus the amount of electricity that's coming into the, uh, into the home. Um, so a heat pump is on average about four times more efficient than a gas boiler. If you are you know, in the middle of summer and you have a highly insulated house, that can be even up to five times more efficient. So you know, it will still even be uh, more efficient than a gas boiler even in Arctic temperatures. But how efficient are they in terms of heating the space? Do they take much longer than a gas boiler or is it fairly similar? I would say actually it's not just fairly similar, they can actually be quicker. Um, in t especially in terms of high temperature heat pumps. If you would like your space to heat up significantly faster over time, that's possible. However, it's not quite how octopus think about it. We think more about how do you heat the system uh, to make sure that the customer is actually comfortable in the most energy efficient way. So instead of uh, considering this as how fast can I heat my space, we actually think about heating the space when it's cheapest um, 
so that the customer is comfortable as soon as they are using that space. Warm when they need to be warm. What more could you possibly yeah. want? So are all homes suited to a heat pump? So the National Infrastructure Commission, uh, which obviously is something that uh, you know, is actually commissioned by the government, says that 90% of homes can have a heat pump fitted. At Octopus, we're going after about 80% of all homes, houses which are already ready for install, uh, for insulation, but so many houses are ready for heat, pump, uh, heat pumps to be fitted. There are two houses here, one that is typical of a house built in the 90s and one that's typical of a house built in the 70s. And between them, they represent about 40 to 50% of UK housing stock, making them perfect proving grounds to really stress test the Octopus portfolio of technologies and to see how efficient they can be. In terms of the number of households here in the UK that heat pumps, we are so early on in our mm. journey and there's a huge amount of work to do. What's Octopus's aspiration in this regard? We're currently installing thousands of heat pumps and we're actually now the, the largest uh, heat pump installer in the UK after the last kind of two years of, of ramp up. We are doing a number of different things to kind of really sort of turbocharge this. The first is we are hiring 3,000 installers this year. Um, oh that's across God. low carbon technology, but uh, this is all kind of external uh, new new hires into uh, into heat pumps, solar panels, and and uh, EV chargers, batteries, things like this. But the majority of those will actually go into heat pumps. Um, on top of that, we are making the most of everything that the government offers in terms of the um, boiler upgrade scheme, the grant. So customers can now get seven and a half thousand pounds from the government to be able to uh, actually get a heat pump. So the kind of combination of those two things, us really ramping up our ability to install, as well as the customers being able to understand how those heat pumps can be applied to their homes is, um, uh, it's a magical time, yeah. <laughs> Installing hundreds of thousands of heat pumps is going to require many more thousands of engineers to install them. Unfortunately, Octopus is hiring very rapidly and also training those engineers very rapidly too. And here they can learn how to install heat pumps, solar panels, uh, do heat surveys and do all the bits and bobs that tie those things together as well. So let's assume that there's a house that doesn't need to have the same sort of radiator or pipe um, upgrades and it is already pretty well insulated. Mm -hmm. How much do they need to set aside for a heat pump? So the average amount that customers are currently paying uh, for Octopus Energy installs is about £500, which is actually less than a gas boiler. Although it's worth saying that we do actually have customers who are now getting that for free. How much are, peop are people saving on average on their bills? On average, customers are saving £220 a year. Uh, that's our you know, forecast savings and that's what we're actually seeing customers come through at versus a gas boiler. As much as we love geeking out on the physics of how heat pumps work, ultimately, we just want to be assured that they're going to work in every condition possible and be as efficient as possible. And right here, they're testing them at minus 10 degrees and two degrees, as well as they're able to test them at really hot temperatures too. And in here is something rather special called an anechoic chamber. And you might have seen images of these anechoic chambers where they have these foam sort of spikes that make sure that you can test how noisy different things are. And in there they can test how noisy heat pumps are because ultimately they are going to live outside your home and you want to be assured that they're operating as quietly as possible. If someone has a combi boiler, what do they do? At the moment, most homes will need a hot water cylinder uh, or a hot water tank. Um, there are lots of homes that already have space for hot water tanks um, and many of those actually have modern hot water tanks already. Uh, but that is something that is, you know, is, is necessary. However, with a very high temperature heat pump, um, you may need fewer radiators, which is actually much more suited to a combi boiler system. Uh, so it's, uh, yeah, you need a little bit of space for a tank, uh, but ultimately the overall system shouldn't have to change too much. If people already have things like solar panels, a battery from a different brand, they might not be on an octopus energy electricity tariff, can they, can they get a Cozy? Absolutely. So um, a Cozy 6 is for octopus and non-octopus customers alike. Um, we install 
for octopus and non-octopus customers across a range of different things and we try and integrate that as much as possible to make the customer's life the easiest. We do have a technology platform called Kraken and this actually underpins everything that Octopus does. The benefit of being an Octopus customer in that scenario is that you have a single data source where uh, your energy consumption uh, or generation, if it's solar panels, can all be mapped in a single place in one app. It really feels as if Octopus are working as hard as they possibly can to make heat pumps as accessible as they possibly can. Right from the cost, to the installation, to training people, to how they operate in your home, to how you pay for your electricity and pay as little as possible too. We love heat pumps here on the Everything Electric Show, so please do make sure to check out all of our other episodes that we have. Let us know what you think of this one in the comments. Please do like and subscribe, and if you have been, thank you for watching.